Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Last week, I let you know that Windows 11 23H2, KB5058405, which was the May Patch Tuesday security update for Windows 11 23H2 and 22H2, was failing to install with error 0xc0000098, and that was in the acpr.sys file. And as I mentioned in the video, the error appears in the Windows recovery environment and points to a problem with the acpr.sys file, which is a core system driver responsible for power management on Windows PCs. Video will be linked. Now, just to let you know that fortunately, Microsoft now on their known Issues Health dashboard page has said that the issue has been resolved. With Microsoft saying that the issue is resolved in the out of band OOB update KB5062170, which is only available via the Microsoft Update catalog. So you're not going to get this update through Windows Update. You have to download and install the update manually from the catalog. And Microsoft says that if you experience this issue, or if you have not yet deployed the May 2025 Windows Security Update on the Windows versions listed, which is 23H2 and 22H2, and your RT environment includes devices running in a virtual desktop infrastructure, Microsoft says it recommends you apply the out-of-band update instead. Now just take note that this update will not install on systems that successfully applied KB5058405, which was the May Patch Tuesday security update. So you only install this update, which is an emergency out-of-band update, if you get the error as mentioned and the update 5058405 is failing to install. Now, you'll notice that the different listings are not in English. And I have found that sometimes the Microsoft, Microsoft Update Catalogs, they give um, the different details in a foreign language. But what you need to know is for 22H2, this will be 64-bit. 23H2, 64-bit. 23H2, ARM, 22H2, ARM. Okay? And if you don't know how to download and install an update manually from the update catalog, I'll leave a video linked down below and in the end screen that will explain how to do that. And this catalog will also be linked with the relevant update if you were affected. So nice to see that a fix has rolled out already. And I think that this will be affecting more corporations and enterprises than your average home user. But just keeping you guys posted like we like to do on the channel. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.